あっ自分ね<笑> I really don't know what to say. I don't really know. What does it mean to be a woman? I like being a woman. I love it. I like the fact that we can have kids and, you know, we can, you know, we've got something to contribute to the world by, you know, bringing more people into the world. Today. I'm child free, so I don't have that. Okay, I'm a widow now, so I was always dependent on a man, but now I have to be more independent. But people won't accept it because so many of the time people think of like it as being delicate and able to be soft and stuff. But because you're a woman, you have to go against so much stuff and you have to fight for so much stuff just so you can be seen at the same sort of level and be looked at with the same respect. So being a woman just means you have to be that much more resilient. It's still very male female world, you know, and we've got to be, try to be stronger. Because we don't have a man behind us anymore. I don't know. I just, I like it. It's pretty cool. It's better than being a man. <laughs> <laughs> I definitely think that there is a perception, and when you are in and amongst a group of guys, they, there's a tendency to maybe overlook what you say. And it's like buying, if you want to buy a car, they're so demeaning. Feel so demeaning because there's, oh, well, do you like this colour? You know, like you don't do the research. It's even just the simple things when you're walking down the street and you get beeped at, like it's not needed. And before, like, I've had people pull up in their cars and ask if you want a lift or tell you to get in when you know it's not right at all. I've been in very violent relationships and felt disrespected, you know, like we're weak and we're not good enough. So I feel like, you know, a lot of my boyfriends have disrespected me in that way by putting their hand on me. So, yeah. Quality. <laughs> it's, it's the same as it's always been. It's been made do, some think, strides, mm, but not many. I don't I think. Don't think Look at the housework. Oh, sorry, Pat. No, I don't think there's total equality in any, anything. Anything. I mean, like my nephew said the other day, that men are the superior race, and I'm like, seriously, you need to really sit down and think about what you're saying. Well, we just want the same rights as men, and to be treated the same. If well, if two people go for a job, male or female, it should be on qualifications. Not whether you're a childbearing age or whether you've got children already who might be ill and you've got to take time off. Whether you're single you know, parent. Yeah. There's lots of things. And people, if they think you're going to need maternity leave, they don't want to know you or they will pay you less. We should be recognised more for the things we do. We stay at home all day and look after our children. And, you know, men should, you know, come home and go... You sit down and let me do this for you for once. Respect, I think, more than anything. I'd, I'd like my opinion to be just as valid because I'm black, white, tall, small, fat, thin. I'd like to be able to wear what I want without anyone placing comment on it all the time or deciding that it defines who I am or what I am. I'd like to be able to stand next to somebody who's got makeup and heels on and be able to have a, the same discussion as someone who's decided they just want to wear trackies and it not be about what they've decided to wear because that person may feel beautiful but the person in the tracksuit may just equally feel beautiful and that's okay and it shouldn't just be about that. <laughs>